To add table of contents to your Google Docs, first things first, you have to set where the headings and the subheadings and the sub subheadings are going to be. This is a document I'm using as my demo, and I'll click on this introduction here, which I want to be my heading one, and I'll go here where it says styles and click this job down and come over here and tap on heading one because i've set my heading one the font is looking like same font that i used in my document i'm going to go over and set where i want it to have heading two i'm going to select this and come here and choose heading two if you notice this changed to blue so i'm going to come here and reduce the size to what i want the size to look like and I'm going to change the color to pure black. And I'm going to choose the same font in my document, which is poppins. I'm going to select the semi bold. And once I'm done with these settings, I'm going to go back into here and click here and update heading to match. That way, anytime I click on heading two, it's going to carry this. So you can do the same if you have more than one heading, heading three, heading four. You can set it so you don't have to go through this process over again. So I'm going to go ahead and set for others, then we'll come back and insert our table of contents. Now that I'm through inserting my heading and subheading, now I want them to be in this document. To see what you've done, you just hover here where it says show tabs and outline. You can see everything you've done. We'll tap on introduction. You see it's moving around. I want it to move. To so insert my table of content, I'm going to place my cursor where I want my table of content to be. And I'm going to go over here where it says insert and come down to where it says table of content and just go here and choose which of this table of content I want to use. I'm just going to pick this one and you see it has inserted my table of content. I'm going to click Ctrl Enter. Yes, that did a page break for me. So I have this table of content here. If at any point you want to do more formatting to your table of content, you can just come to the table of content and come to this three dot and more options you can do what you want if i click on show tab header you see it does give it these lines i can choose what lines i want to use if you come to heading levels you can see the measurements you want to use to measure your heading level like this video if you got value from it and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this do have a good one